This is the Headhunter Pump Tune-Up Procedure. Please use this as a guide to improve your vessel's water pressure and flow. Here's a list of the steps in the procedure. We will also list the steps below. Make sure all tanks are filled with water. Locate your accumulator or accumulators in your system. Accumulators come in all types of shapes and sizes. Accumulators store pressurized water using a bladder or diaphragm, like a balloon. These help when water is in high demand on board the vessel. While system is pressurized, test the Schrader valve on all accumulator tanks to ensure no water leaks out. Depress the pin in the center of the valve. If water leaks from the Schrader, then you will need to replace the accumulator tank. Shut off all water pumps and disconnect shore water pressure. Open 6 to 10 faucets to relieve the water pressure. Remove or bypass any filtration elements in the piping, if there is any. Be sure not to confuse your filtration element with a strainer like this. Sizes may vary. Strainers like this one are used for coarse filtration on the suction side of the pump and do not restrict the flow of water, whereas filters are used on the discharge side of the pump. Once water pressure is relieved, check the air pressure in the accumulator tanks. The air pressure should be between 30 and 35 psi. Recharge the accumulator tank if needed. If tank does not hold air, then the accumulator tank needs to be replaced. It's important to fill the pump with water to start the priming process. Make sure to replace the priming plug. The pump will need to expel air in the system to prime. Start pump 1. Allow water to start flowing from the faucets. Once water is flowing, shut pump off and allow pressure to bleed off so that more air in the pump can be expelled on each restart. Restart the pump several times to ensure all air has been purged. Repeat this step with pump two or any other pumps in the system. Close all faucets. Restart all pumps and allow system to pressure up. Check that pumps shut off normally under pressure. If pump shuts off under alarm after performing the procedure, then air leaks in the pump's suction plumbing are likely. Please see suction leak identification video. Reinstall any filters or elements after successfully running the water pressure system.